The what? The person who is uh, graduating now. Uh, What's the name given to the person? The graduator. The graduator? <laughs> <laughs> A-G-R-A-D-U-A-T-E Continentex 211 Educating the youths through films Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Dan 21 YouTube channel. Today we are having a different kind of a video. Uh, I'm going to be asking some of the students who are graduating from different universities in India, uh, both from undergrads and postgrads. If you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button like the video, comment and share. Let's get into the video. Today I'm here with Nasra Haraj from Somalia. From Somalia? Yeah. All right. Uh, which course did you study? I study business management. In which university? Singana University. All right. Uh, you know, outside there, studies in India are not, are not that good. And if you have uh, finished, uh, it is a great pleasure to yourself, to your country and Africa at large. Uh, what will you say about today's uh, event? Today's event is really amazing. But thanks for the, you know, Afro-Asian. I really enjoyed the party and I'm really glad that I, I, I joined this party today. Alright, since you are going back to your country, what will you miss about India? Uh, India, well, I, India is like the like one of my second country, you know. Like yes. I have spent here like more than 15 years. Okay. So it's like my, I'm like, <laughs> India just adopted me, you know. All right. Yeah, it's my second country, so I'm gonna miss everything. All right. Uh, what Every will you, corner of India. Thank you so much. What will you tell to the Somalians who are watching right now and Africans who are watching right now? Because a lot of people are watching from from Africa, Europe, America about education. Like, what will you tell them? I'll tell them like you know, explore, do everything in life you want. Like you know, whatever it is, don't be scared of failure. You know, life is all about like adventure and. The more you like, not scared of failure, the more you know, life will, you will go ahead of. Th thank you so much. I have last question for you. Yeah. Uh, how do you call a person who is graduating? Person who is graduating? Yes. A graduator? What is the spelling? Graduate. <laughs> You're gonna challenge, yeah. You're gonna challenge me, eh? Yeah? What's, the, what's the spelling? Graduate. G R A. G R A. D U. D U. A. A. T E R. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, today I'm here with Jermaine Petronella Tapomangoni from from Zimbabwe. From Zimbabwe. Yes. Uh, all right. Uh, which which course did you do? I'm doing medical laboratory technology. Uh, which university? Marish Makandeshwa from Mariana. From Mariana. Yes. All right. Uh, thank you so much for talking to me. Uh, you know, outside there, India is not uh, is not easy. Studies in India are so hard. So when you when you graduate. Uh, it is a pleasure to yourself, to your country, and uh, Africa also, even to the world. That's uh, true. Yeah, we really appreciate that. Uh, what What will you say about the graduation now? Ah, uh, the graduation was nice. Uh, we are so happy with the day. Mm. Uh, we hope it's gonna be the same for the next year, for the next uh, graduation, like for the upcoming uh, graduators. <laughs> All right. Uh, when you're going back, uh, what 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 will you miss about India? I'm gonna miss the spices. <laughs> Only spices? Have you met some Indian friends? Yeah, I've met some few few Indians, but most they are my classmates. Only your classmates. You will miss them also, right? Yeah, I'll miss them so much. Alright, I thank you so much. What do you tell the, the students who are watching right now? Because a lot of them are watching from Africa, from okay. Asia, from Europe, everywhere. Uh, what will you tell them about the education, the life, like some advice for them? Yeah, the only thing that I can say that um, India, when it comes to medical side and also engineering, is the best country to choose your career. Yeah. That's so you, you should come to India if you feel like? Yeah, you have to. If you feel like coming to India, you have to come. All right, I have, yeah. I have last question for you. Uh, the person who is graduating is called what? The what? The person who is uh, graduating now. Uh, What's the name given to the person? The graduator. The graduator? <laughs> <laughs> you spell it. <laughs> you spell it. Spelling. Yeah. Okay, G R A D U A T E R. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> What's your name? 
Uh, my name is uh, Samba Sise. Okay, Samba from which country? Uh, I'm from Guinea Conakry. All right. Republic of Guinea. All right. Which which course did you do? Yeah, I did uh, technology of uh, structural engineering. At uh, which university? Uh, at lovely professional university. All right. Uh, what will you miss about India? Yo, I miss the uh, first of all. I will miss the Indian people. Okay. And again, I will miss uh, Indian okay. culture. Okay. Yeah, and Indian th thinking and pressure. All right. All right. Yeah, because uh, we are uh, not, uh, you know. Uh, uh, we do know this uh, already. Okay. So we uh, we start this here. Uh, we study in the pressure. All right, all right. Thank you so much, bro. Uh, how do you call person who is graduating? Graduating is a graduate student. All right. What's the spelling? Graduate student is J. J. R. Yes. A. Yes. D. Yes. U. Yes. A. Yes. T. Yes. E. Thank you so much, bro. Yeah. Uh, today I'm here with Emanuela. Emanuela from which country? Uh, South Sudan. From South Sudan? Yeah. I'm a South Sudanese too. Yeah, then we are from the same country. All right, uh, which course did you study, Emanuela? I'm doing MSc Microbiology. Or oh, Microbiology. Uh, yeah. This is a great uh, achievement for yourself, for South Sudan and, Thank you. and Africa. Studies in India are not easy. Uh, what, will, what will you say about today's uh, event? Uh, I thank God for everything. It's been a hard experience, tough. But now we are graduating, so we are proud. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, what will you tell to the viewers who are watching right now, the students? Because a lot of students are watching from Africa, from South Sudan, from everywhere, even in Asia and Europe. What will you tell the students regarding education and life? Uh, in India? Yeah, yeah, like advice to them. I advise them to come here and study. Uh, study abroad is not easy, and like India also, it's not easy. So, you need to come to achieve your dream, so you need to... Alright, as you are going to South Sudan very soon, what will you miss about India? I miss everything, food, Yes. Yeah. first of all, then my friends, yes. my teacher, yes. even I have family here. Alright, so you will miss them too? Yeah. Alright, I, I have a last question here. for you. Mm -hmm. uh, a person who is graduating is called what? A graduate? Uh, can you spell it? Graduate. Yes. G U yes. R A yes. D yes. E T E. Yes. Thank you so much, Manuela. <laughs> uh, today I'm here with. Uh, my name is Berite Karamo from Guinea Conakry in West Africa. Uh, I'm a student at uh, Delhi University okay. where I graduated uh, last month with uh, a master degree in business administration. Master degree in business administration. Yeah, and I was very lucky. I attended one of the best school, best B school in India, which is FMS, Faculty of Management Study. Uh, this is, you are very happy of today's event, right? Uh, of course, I'm very happy because this is a great milestone in my life, a very great step that I've done in my life. You know, studying in foreign country is not uh, almost easy. It's a very, very difficult task. Yes. So making it uh, like this till the success is something that you should be excited and happy with it. Exactly. So exactly. I'm very excited. Uh, exactly. Thank and you so much. Uh, I, yeah. As you're going back to your country, what will you miss about India? Oh, everything, everything. You know, India is a very great country and diverse, uh, of course. I will miss their food, uh, my friend, the environment itself. Everything, I will, be, I will miss everything about uh, India. Uh, all right, um, uh, all right. I have a last question for you. Uh, a person who is graduating is called? A graduate. What the spelling? Oh, it is G-R-E-D-U-A-T-E. -E. Thank you so much, bro. Thank you, it's my pleasure. All right. Uh, today I'm here with Mohamed Lamin Keita. Mohamed, uh, which country? I'm from Gambia. From Gambia. Uh, Mohamed, wh which course did you study? I studied uh, BCom Honors. BCom Honors from, honors. Delhi, from Delhi University. All right. I know. I know. Studying in India uh, can be so hard. And uh, do you have uh, the the challenges you faced? Uh, mm -hmm. One one to two challenges that you faced in when you were studying. Yeah, there are some challenges we face here when we come as foreign students, like uh, the cultural shock and then the communication gap. Like when you come initially, you cannot speak Hindi and like you have some problems talking to drivers or the shopkeepers. So that's a challenge. But uh, and also the food also. Like if you grow up from uh, Africa and you are used to that food, you come here. Like here, the food might be slightly different, so it's difficult sometimes to adjust to that. All right, but, uh, yeah. 
All right, thank you so much. Uh, what will you miss about India since you are living for yeah. India? Uh, and uh, I just heard you also got the scholarship to, uh, to to pursue your your masters here. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Yeah, first of all, I feel very excited uh, because once again I have to uh, go and pursue my masters for for free. Yeah, so that is an excitement for me, and it's also like a sense of achievement too. I feel very happy and thankful to the Indian government. All right, yeah. all right. Thank you so much, Mr. Yeah. Mohammed. What do you have to tell uh, the students who are watching right now? Because a lot of students are watching from different parts mm. in Africa, in Asia, uh, mm. America, everywhere in the world. They are watching yeah. right now. What do you have to tell them regarding your like the struggle? In education mm. uh, do you have any message for them yeah of course like all I all I can tell them is that let them not uh, give up like anything is possible whatsoever they put their mind and focus on it is achievable as long as they have the, the consistency and the determination to do it they can do it so like they can also get this too even what is better what matters is just not to give up and put the eyes on the goal keep pushing and like one day surely it's gonna happen all right i have, I have some question to ask you uh, the last one a, a person who is graduating is called what graduant a graduate can you spell that that g-r-a-d-u-a-n-t okay thank you <laughs> <laughs> uh today i'm here with kazungu chengo bengala from from which country from kenya from kenya uh yes. bro uh which course did you do i i did Bachelor of Science in Statistics. A Bachelor of Science in Statistics. Uh, which university? In the University of Delhi. Oh, Delhi University. Uh, all right. This is the very good day. You should be congratulated because uh, studies in India are not so so easy. Uh, we have to thank God about that. And uh, what will you say about your graduation now? Actually, I feel so happy because I, it's been a, a very difficult journey since the beginning, but now. Now that I have come to the graduation part, it's like a dream come true. All right, uh, this means uh, uh, this means a, a huge achievement to yourself, to your country, uh, to Africa and the world also. Since you are going to Kenya very soon, what will you miss about uh, India? Actually, what I miss about India specifically is, I think the the kind of friends I have built ever since I came here have met up with some very wonderful people, very welcoming, people who are vicious, who are ambitious, and we have shared ideas, we have learned quite a lot, and I'm gonna miss all that, you know. All, all right, uh, thank you so much. Uh, do you have any information to the viewers, the students, because there are a lot of students who are watching right now from Africa. What I'll tell them is, actually you have to do what you do in a better way, just strive. Strive to, uh, to achieve your goals and never give up. All right, thank you so much. I have a last question for you. How do you call the person who is graduating? He's a graduate. What's the spelling? G-R-A-D-U-A-T-I. Ah. Sorry, yeah. sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. May I repeat it, please? Repeat, repeat it. G-R-A-T-U-A-T-E. Yeah. Thank you so much. Today I'm here with... Jokwala Rupwal. Jok? Jokwala Rupwal. All right. Jokwala Rupwal. Yeah. Which course did you do? Uh, I did uh, B.Tech uh, in Mechanical Engineering. B.Tech in Mechanical? Engineering. All right. Yes. The university? The university is in Madhavi University. All right. Uh, Rajasthan. Rajasthan. Okay. Uh, which country are you from? Yes. 100% South Sudanese. A South Sudanese. All right, I'm also South Sudanese. Uh, in case you do not know, a lot of people there they are watching right now, and uh, they also know the studies in India are not that easy. Uh, you have gone through a lot, and uh, we have to thank you, and we have to also thank God for achieving this. Uh, what message would you tell them? Uh, this one is very it was long, long, hard way. I have suffered a lot, but you know, at the end, yeah, I have achieved. It. All right. So, yeah. All right, uh, this means a very huge achievement to yourself, to yes. the country, and the Africa, country well. even to the to the world. world uh, yes. We are so grateful for that. Uh, what will you miss about India in case you are going back to South Sudan? What particular thing will you miss about India? Uh, actually, the environment here was so good, therefore, and the friends, I will miss my friends also from other countries. And, but for South Sudan, of course, I will meet them there. But other, I have some really, really best friend who is still with me. So we me in this uh, in this uh, journey. So, but
Regarding the India, India it has a lot of because we know it is very developed country. Yeah, yeah we miss a lot, a lot of services in this country. But uh, but we have. We, we hope that uh, this service will be there soon also. In South Sudan? In South Sudan. That's what we want to do even. All right. Yeah, to provide it there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. studying mechanical engineering uh, is so, is, is that, it's such, it's such a big, uh, it's such a big uh, course uh, in South Sudan. Uh, we wish you to go and apply what you studied here. What do you have to tell the students who are watching right now? Because a lot of students are watching from Africa, from Europe, from America, from everywhere they are watching right now. What do you tell them about uh, uh, life? What do you have to tell them about education? Yes, about education. Yeah. Our country needs us so badly. It needs us. So we have to work hard. We have to get the knowledge that needed to develop our country. As you know, we're still a young country that we have just started. Then we hope so. We, I'm giving the message to the other Sudanese students, uh, South Sudanese students, to achieve their goal quickly and they come back and then to, you know, develop the country as soon as possible. Because it is very, our country needs us. All right. Uh, thank, you, thank you so much, bro. Uh, I have a last question for you. How do you call a person who is graduating? Yeah. <laughs> this is a tricky question. Is someone graduate? So, bachelor? Uh, it's called a graduate, right? Can you spell it? G-R G-R A-D A-D U U T-E-D T-E T-A-D T-A-D Thank you so much, bro. You're welcome. Uh, today I'm here with. I'm Edwin Kipchirji Gupta from Kenya. You're from Kenya. Uh, yes, which yes. course did you study? Yeah, I did Master's of Science in Chemistry. At yeah. uh, which university? I'm from Delhi University. Delhi University? Yes. yes. All right, uh, Edwin, uh, you know it is known outside there, uh, studies in India are so hard. And uh, you, uh, somebody there may, may think uh, it is easy. Like, what do you have to tell to the viewers here? Yeah, the studies in here. As from uh, me, in the first place, I had some challenges, but uh, I was able to cope up with the environment and everything. Uh, there are some challenges, of course, like language barrier. Or sometimes the teachers don't get us well. Difference in education system sometimes, but after all that, I could say that India is actually a good place to study, in, especially if you want to. Uh, pass easily, India is a good deal for you. Alright, uh, today is your graduation day. Uh, it is a good day for yourself, for your country and for Africa, even for the world. Uh, we also have to appreciate God and uh, uh, what do you have to tell to the viewers here who are watching, the students from Africa who are watching from uh, from Asia, from uh, Europe, from America, they are watching here. What do you have to tell them? Yeah, I'm so grateful for this day. I'm very happy that uh, I'm graduating finally after three years in this Masters of Chemistry. And uh, I want to encourage all the African students that uh, everything is possible. Like, uh, whenever you're pushing on for your goals, for your dreams, never give up on them. It's all very important never to give up. All right, thank Just you so much. Uh, what, what, will you, what will you miss about India since you are leaving for, for Kenya? What exactly thing you will miss about India? Yeah, I like the environment, the people are very calm. My friends, the international students especially, in the likes of Mukalani, Dani, Ia, yeah. Mikado. They're very nice guys, and what I miss is like that cultural diversity a lot. All right, all right, thank you so much. I have a last question for you. Uh, who is graduating? Is called what? The, a graduate. What? What the spelling? G R A D U A T E. Thank you so much. Welcome, then. <laughs> uh, today I'm here with Daphne Chamisa from from Zimbabwe. From Zimbabwe. Yeah. Uh, which which course did you do? BTEC Computer Science Engineering. Wow, wow, wow. Which university? I'm from Punjab Technical University. So you came from Punjab? Yes. All right, uh, the studies in India are very hard. Yeah. Outside there, people know India is very hard in terms of education. So what do you have to say about today's event? Okay, uh, actually, first I want to thank the um, people who have organized this event. It was really a success and we really enjoyed and enjoyed how we have su we succeeded and the efforts that we have made. Thank you. All right. What will you miss about India? The culture, everything about India. Okay. The culture, especially how the people are good and friendly. Okay. The teachers, they are so cooperative. 
All right, what is your message to the viewers who are watching? Okay, fine. Uh, to the students who are watching who are already in India, I just want to say you guys keep on keeping on. Being successful is a good thing. And to the people who are outside India who wish to come and study here, trust me, this is the best thing ever you can do for yourself. And don't forget to join the Afro-Asian graduation whenever you're going to see it because it's amazing. Thank you so much. Uh, I have a last question for you. Yes. Uh, a person who is graduating in school, who is graduating? Yeah, a person who is graduating is called what? A graduate. What the spelling? G A G R A D U A T E. Thank you so much. You're welcome.